Hey, welcome back, everybody. It looks great out there today. We are surrounded uh, by computer programs indoors these days, and now more and more kids are learning the invaluable trade. Not only does it help them understand the world around them, but it can be fun. So often kids complain about being bored. Danielle Busby has six kids to entertain, all girls, her quintuplets, and her older daughter, Blake. And she's here now along with Christopher Ellis and Renee Hines with Idea Lab Kids Houston. Good morning to all of you. Good hey, morning. Hey. Thanks for being here. So, Danielle, you've got the six girls. I do. And STEM is really something that's important to you guys. And I know on your social media, you and your husband talk about mm -hmm. breaking down those gender barriers. Yep. Why is STEM so important to y'all? It just really is important because we do have six girls, and we want to ensure that they have equal opportunity to learn about science, engineering, math, and technology. And, mm -hmm. you know, that's why we partnered with Learning Resources to kind of create fun, um, easy ways for you to show your kids at an early age. And... You know, we have um, actually a play date set up today for Blake with our friends to play with Botley, the coding robot, who is so much fun in our house. And um, But yeah, I mean, Idea Lab is going to be there mm -hmm. and having some activities um, to do with Botley and just have a fun little party. But Her seventh uh, birthday is coming her up. Her seventh birthday. So Botley is a good friend. And how does Botley, Botley. work? You want to show us? So Botley is a brand new coding robot from Learning Resources. Mm -hmm. He's completely screen free, which is appeal to most parents. Right. No screen time whatsoever. You code him through this remote that we have here. Um, what we set up is this small experiment with Botley. He's going to set off a catalyst with our Idea Labs Elephant Toothpaste. Okay, you want to go ahead and show us how to do this and what Absolutely. ages is this good for? So this is appropriate from ages, you can go from 5 to 9 or 5 to 10 if you tweak it just a little bit. Okay, all right, let's see what Botley can do. Okay, so what we've created was a game with Botley. Mm -hmm. We called it Chemical Reactions with Botley. Here you'll see a question. It says which ingredient causes the exothermic reaction in Idea Lab Toothpaste? Case. So is it going to be vinegar or hydrogen peroxide? I'm going to go with hydrogen peroxide today. Yeah, we'll today. go with that one. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to turn Botley on here at the top. Okay. And then we're going to press this button to transmit his code. All right. Normally they would enter that code in. Enter it in and now he's going to move? Yes. And what's he doing now? He so he's just grabbing our catalyst. Okay. And he's going to bring it all the way back to me. Oh, how fun! And this is something Blake enjoys oh, doing yes. at home, right? So your quints are only two years old. They'll be uh, three. They'll be three soon. Are, are they already showing different personalities? Oh, are all some so different. Are some drawn to, to science already at that young of of an course, age? Of course, yes. You know, Botley actually brings toilet paper around to the bathroom. Because <laughs> we go through that like crazy with potty training right now. So Botley can really help you out oh, yeah, now, right? Sure. Being a busy mom. <laughs> so how many seasons have you guys had so far of your, of your show We've out now? Three so far. Three seasons. I know your fans are wondering about a new season. Is there anything you can tell us yet, Daniel? Maybe one day. Maybe one day. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe one day. All right. We'll have to go with that so for now. Uh, and, and on your blog, I mean, uh, people learn all kinds of things about your family. For, for parents at home who are maybe watching now who think, I can't possibly set up science or right. arts and crafts. I'm just too busy even with one child at home. Right. What are some of your tips to, to getting activities set up ahead of time for your kids before they wake up and take over the house? Right. I mean, honestly, helping with learning to code and stuff is super simple with just like activities I do daily, like mm -hmm. laundry, uh, the dishwasher, sorting utensils out, um, you know, coloring with numbers, like put numbers in spots and let them color. I mean, these are all things that we do on the daily um, that the kids, as long as you make it interesting and mm -hmm. fun play they don't know that they're doing chores or coding or learning but um yeah, I mean, I actually wrote a blog about it on learningresources.com with a couple ideas and how games you can play with sure. your kids. You've uh, got to, let to them make learn. the learning. You got to make it fun. And make it have to make look it fun. Like play. <laughs> Why is STEM so important, even to, to young kids who aren't necessarily even in elementary school yet, to start laying that foundation of science, technology, engineering, and math? Well, the scientific method is important in all walks of life. You use it every day. You use it out in nature. You use it in art. And, you know, that's what we focus on. We incorporate the arts into STEM and make it STEAM so that uh, we can make it fun mm -hmm. and we can appeal to a broad variety of curriculums. Mm -hmm. You guys have one more experiment you want to show us, or are we all done? I think we're all done. Okay. We, 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 um, you can do so much with this robot. Mm -hmm. yeah, I mean, oh, yeah. it's super cool. Um, 
and we really love w working with the robot. We've been able to develop some really neat curriculum with it. Well, we appreciate y'all coming Thank on and you. showing us. You Thank guys you. have franchises across Houston, so yes. people can look up Idea Lab. Danielle, when the summer's out, you got to bring all the kids in of for course, us. Which sure. is always chaotic in the newsroom, so we'd <laughs> love to see all six girls in here. And happy birthday to it. your oldest one, <laughs> Melissa Tom.